is she and really worth it? Guys, I got my package from Shein, which I'm so excited about. Today when I was at work, the guy, what's it called, the DHL guy called me and he was like, hi, um, I'm here with the package. Where do you want me to leave it? And I'm just like, sir, I'm not home. Can you please just leave it? Go in the back and leave it. And he was like, um, yeah, okay. So I got this little dress to like pretty much wear around the house. And this is straight out of the bag. Everything feels good. The dress is like a decent material, which I really like, cause truth is I was kind of worried. I'm gonna try these pieces on so you guys can see them. But the first item is, the first item is this dress and I don't know what it's called. Let me see if I can find a thing. I also got this coin purse with my purchase and one of the kids are gonna be so excited to get this coin purse. I think it's so cute. It actually looked bigger on there, but I guess now it makes sense because it did say a coin purse. So I think that's super cute. I'm used to getting like um, the return sheet and then a list of all the things that I bought. So pretty much like an invoice from like Fashion Over, but this is not Fashion Over, so I guess don't expect the same thing, or I haven't found it yet. Then I got this really, really cute purse. And it has like a little scarf attached to it. I think it's really cute. I don't go out very, very often, but I am hoping that I'll go out soon and actually get to wear it. I'm gonna go on there and leave a review of these items at least the chain doesn't smell like um, metal because I don't really like that but um yeah the bag isn't amazing um, quality what the hell happened the bag is not the most amazing quality but it's okay so this is the little purse I like it I think it'll work for what I want it for. Okay, there are just some codes on the bag. There isn't really names to anything. Oh, I got this top and I got these in, oh, this is a large. Oh, because I seen it tied on the um, website, on the picture, and I wanted to tie it, so I got a large, but I love the little heart on the front. The material is really nice. Then I have this other one. What does it say? Living my best life. This is a medium and it's really cute. I decided to try some fun colors. I think these colors will look really good on my skin tone. So um, yet yeah, I got two pajama sets and a bathing suit. I'm excited about pajama sets because I love pajamas. Um. The bathing suit, what size did I get this in? Medium. I don't know if it's gonna fit me, but I love, I think this detail on a bathing suit is really sexy, and this is one of the ones that goes high. Did I get two or did I get one? I'm gonna have to figure it out, but I really love the bottom. Hope I go to the beach to get to wear it. And the top is super cute. I'm gonna try on the top so, um, so y'all can see but everything looks really good. The top has um, a padding inside of it. I may or may not take it out. I don't know yet, but so far, I really like it. It looks like what I expected it to be, I guess. So there's that for the bathing suit. Or the bikini rather. Then I got another dress to wear like inside the house. I like to wear um, simple, cute things in and around the house. So this is like the other t-shirt dress. It's blue and white and it's nice and flowy. The material of this one is good, it's stretchy. And I also got this in a medium. So I'm gonna try them on so you guys can see them when I'm done. I 
I got this top. This is also medium. It has this cactus on there, or cacti, cactus. It says the wildest is cactus, but it is a little big, or I guess I'm gonna have to wait until I try it on to really be able to tell. Looks a little wide, but I'll see. Oh yeah, I got two bikini. I got this other one, which I thought was really cute. I really just hope it fits me. I don't know if it's gonna fit, but the bottoms I really like. Love this for me. Maybe I'm gonna save the um the bikini for like a bikini slash bathing suit try on haul. I don't know, I'll see. Like I said, I got some really fun colors. Coral and teal are two of my favorite colors and I've been really into yellow and mustard lately. I got this really cute one. I love t-shirts that are written up. I literally just seen you guys through this. So the material on this one is not amazing. This is also medium. I got this AirPod case for my husband because it was really inexpensive on there. Oh wow, it's just like a little skin. Anyways, it's so good because he's a mechanic and his AirPods, or the case rather, looks crazy. So he needs that. I also bought a robe. I really love robes. And Tavia's birthday is coming up and she wants to do like a either lingerie or um, pajama party for her birthday. So this is more like silk and I absolutely love this. I think it's really cute. What size did I get this in? Large. Because I feel like a robe is not supposed, it, you know, it's supposed to fit a little big or a little flowy and it has this little string. It looks like it's, all right, no, it's silk. That's how it's supposed to look, ish. Either silk or sand. What is this? This is another top that says I'm fine. These tops look a little wide, but then when you put them on, it might be a different story, but I absolutely love this. I'm into these cute little colors right now, and the last two pieces that I have are two, um, two pajama sets, the shorts, because obviously it's summer, and I got them in medium too. So this one is black and white. This is what the top looked like. I didn't realize that it was more of like a crop top. It didn't really show that on the website, or maybe it did. But then too, the top is a little wide like everything else. So maybe in tops, I should take small, but the shorts look fine and I think they're really cute. Those are gonna fit. And then the very last one is blue and white. I thought I had enough pinks and stuff, so I got blue one. This is, the material is really good. I'd say buy it. But I think so far what I've seen is maybe size down. So maybe if you wear a medium and you're not um, too big. I also looked at some of the pictures on the reviews that people posted as a reference. Hey. Home. Oh. This is the last piece. Like I was saying, the material on this one is really nice for like pajama. And then this one, I actually really like too. I bought a pajama set on Fashion Nova and, oh, it's right here too. Drawers open. This one. And truth is, uh, they're kind of the same material to be honest, but this one looks like it might hold up a lot longer than this one might. So, um, because it's made of polyester. Oh, that's polyester. This one doesn't tell me what it's made of, but whatever. I I like the material, and then the blue one is nice, and it has like a nice waistband and stuff, which I really like, and it's just really cute. Looks like you're going to bed. And then this is the top. So now I'm gonna try these pieces on so that you guys can see them. These are all the pieces that I got from Shein. Um, out of 10, I'd say eight and a half, nine. 
because I haven't tried these pieces on yet. So I'm gonna try them on and then come back and see. So guys, I'm done trying on all the pieces. Um, I tried the underwear off camera, the bottoms for the bikini off camera, obviously. Um, still haven't tried the top yet, but I think the pieces are cute. The dresses, I don't have any issues with. I love how the dresses fit because they work for what I want them for. I still need to try this bra to see how it fits me. But um, the tops, this yellow top, I didn't necessarily like how the material looked. And around the neck, it looked cheap. Um, some of them were okay. Others, mm, I, I wasn't that okay with. To conclude, will I buy tops from Shein again? I probably will if I see a cute one that I like because it's really a hit or miss. The tops were cheap and um, they're cute. This green one is just very exact. This is a medium, but this is just exact. The tops to me um, seem like if I wash them, they're gonna shrink or they're probably gonna just be different because they are made from not the best material, just okay material, and that is, you know, the truth. I love the robe. This first stuff I absolutely loved. The material is nice and thick. This second one too is okay, and this third one. The two tops that goes with the um, the pajama, those were okay. But these last two, I wasn't so thrilled with, and I really liked these two because of the colors, but for the most part, they're okay. I like them, and I am gonna keep them. I hate returning stuff, but there's nothing in there that I feel like I'd need to return. No, they're okay. So um, that's it for my Shein try-on haul, or is Shein really worth it? It's okay. If you're balling on a budget, you can get some really cute pieces from Shein, and they're possibly gonna last you a little while. If they hold up, then I'll be buying from them again. I feel like I'm gonna buy from them even if they don't hold up because they were cheap, you know? So you can't really complain like that. When you, I feel like when you buy stuff for cheap, you can't really do much complaining because you didn't, you know, you already know buying it cheap that it's not the most amazing quality. I literally have three half bottles of water inside here. So um, yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next video.